Hi, Tim Munkert here, and in this video, we're going to look at using a macro in Nano, the Nano command line text editor, to uh, make blogging in HTML and CSS a little bit easier. Now, you may say, well, why do you want to blog in HTML and CSS instead of WordPress? Well, uh, if you're a developer, um, such as I am, uh, you may just just like this for security purposes, um, HTML and CSS is uh, a bunch more secure than something that has a database and you may just want a simple blog. When I was a math teacher, I used a simple blog with my students. It was just HTML and CSS uh, because it conveyed the information. I didn't need, I didn't want students commenting on the blog. Uh, so anyways, um, the, this is going to help you uh, blog a bit faster. Uh, you know, one of the things about writing in HTML is a little bit of a pain to write the opening and closing tags for paragraphs when you have a ton of paragraphs. So I'm going to show you, you really don't need to do that using a macro. So I've written a bunch of paragraphs and copied some lorem, lorem ipsum text uh, just to have some paragraphs. So I have about seven paragraphs here. So we're going to do a macro in nanos. And to start recording a macro, I'm going to do uh, the alt or meta key and then a colon. So for me, I have to do alt shift and then the colon and the semicolon button. So I'm going to do that alt shift uh, semicolon. Um, and so that's alt colon. Uh, that starts recording a macro. You can see that at the bottom. I'm going to do control A to go to the start of the line. Then I'm going to insert my paragraph tag at the start. Control E to go to the end of the line and then close out my paragraph tag. I'm going to then go down and then hit Alt Shift and the colon semicolon key, which is basically the Alt colon to stop the macro. Okay, so I stopped my macro. Now to run a macro on nanos, I just do Alt and the semicolons. Okay, okay, so down, done. Okay. Now, uh, the difference in a macro between uh, Vim slash NeoVim and Nano is that uh, in Vim or NeoVim, you can type the number of times you want to record the macro. But if you do it like, like this, all you have to do is just do alt semicolon, however many paragraphs you have. It's very quick and uh, you can get it done. And you might say, well, why are you using Nano over Vim or NeoVim. Well, sometimes Nano is simpler. And if you're writing just a simple presentational or just a simple blog, you're trying to get to your students. Um, sometimes the simplest text editor is the nicest. I mean, Nano is very quick to write in. So it's a great text editor and it does have somewhat advanced features like this that can make your um, writing a blog in HTML and CSS very, very easy and very quick. All right. Well, anyways, uh, thanks for watching. I uh, hope this was informative. And if you like this video, please hit the like button and make sure to subscri subscribe as it really helps the channel grow. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.